Hi, welcome in. I'm Nina. I'm an illustrator and comic artist. Welcome to my channel. Today we are drawing chibis. So a lot of people ask me how I make my chibis so cute. Well, it's all up to measurement. Chibis are a kind of deformation. You pick up a character that already exists and you keep its features but you squeeze it and squeeze it until it gets cute and small. But you don't make it look like a baby. It's not a baby version. It's just a tiny version of the same character. So when you're drawing a chibi head to make it look cute and squeezed, keep the chin close to the circle. Like this. This will make the head look bigger, even though it's actually smaller, but it will look bigger because it's very round. Now you can go crazy with the eye size. You can make it big, bigger, huge. Because big eyes are cute. You keep the nose and mouth very small and you may or may not have ears. Now the measurement is very important. We go from the top of the head to the chin. I'm putting this on a different layer, then I'm copying and pasting it and adding it here. And now I have three heads, one, two, three, and that's the measurement for a standard chibi. We have different ones, we go through them later, but we'll begin with this one. Now let's sketch up the body. What we're gonna do here is that on the first head, we'll have the actual head. On the second one, we'll squeeze in the body and on the third one, legs and feet. Everything must fit in three heads. So let's go, let's make a squishy body, kind of like a bean. legs and feet and let's add some arms Now that we have everything measured and the base sketch, let's turn this into an actual drawing.
and we have a cute chibi girl. You can choose a specific character or create your own or add more detailing. I'm keeping it simple for the sake of the tutorial, so we don't waste a lot of time here. Now let's go for the second type of chibi. I mean, since chibis are the formation, there are a lot of types, but let's keep it on two simple kinds of chibis. Now this one is even more squeezed. Let's make a circle and a head. To the other side. Keep it squeezy. Whenever you want to make things cute to make their, they look more round. Now let's make someone who's angry. Now what's the difference? The measurement. Instead of using three heads, we're going crazy on this one. We're using only two heads. Yes, which means one head is the actual head and the other head everything else. You just have to fit everything in here in this space. I know it looks a little bit difficult. It's not as hard as it seems. So let's again make a quick shape for the body. I like to picture it looks like a rice package or a pillow, something like that, a cushion. So I stick to this kind of shape because it bends. It can be to one side or to the other side and you can make poses with that. Let me sketch up the arms. The legs and feet. Everything in only one head. See, it's possible. It's not that hard. Again, let's finish it. such a thing as a angry hair. What I like about chibis is that they can be very expressive. Well, that's it. 
Let me see how your chibis came out. Join our Discord channel and send your own drawings on Show Your Art. Yay, till next! And you may or may not have ears. Oh, come on, this dog. Stop barking. It's not even my dog. <laughs>